In the era of clean energy and sustainable transportation, electric vehicles and charging infrastructure are becoming an integral part of our daily lives. At the Department of Wind and Energy Systems of the Technical University of Denmark, the e-mobility and prosumer integration section is committed to developing solutions for different aspects of electromobility, like battery degradation, smart charges for electric vehicles, power electronic converters, and more. The research team at the Smart Converter Lab works in grid-connected and DC-to-DC -DC power electronic converters for different applications. In particular, the dual active bridge power converter consists of two active bridges interconnected by a power transfer inductance and a high frequency transformer, providing bidirectional power flow capabilities, wide input output voltage range, and high power density, which makes it suitable for applications such as PV systems, EV charging stations, and more. Maintaining battery operation within its safe operating area is essential. We propose a control algorithm that ensures safe voltage and current levels during charging and discharging, preventing any dangerous operations. Using a model predictive voltage control, our proposed approach adjusts the power converter operation to avoid overcurrent. Two algorithms are proposed, which dynamically adjust current saturation or voltage reference. Thanks to any of them, current is limited and the output device is protected achieving precise control, no steady-state error, and fast dynamic response. A dual active bridge setup was built to experimentally validate or control algorithm performance under different scenarios. Let's take a look at our experimental results. First, the code is built and loaded into the control platform. Next, the input voltage source is provided and a black star is implemented to increase the output voltage. Then the closed loop is enabled and the model predictive control takes command of the converter's operation. In this experiment, a battery charging and discharging process is simulated. Current is limited until the output voltage is equal to the reference, allowing to implement a constant current, constant voltage process with model predictive control. Thank you for watching! For a more in-depth understanding of our research, we invite you to access the full paper. Finally, we would like to express our gratitude to IEEE IES for the IES SYPA for their support in our research. Thank you.